Painkillers and Antibiotics by kscience.com. Example of painkillers are paracetamol, aspirin and ibuprofen. These are painkillers. What they do is relieve pain in the body. They relieve the symptoms of pain in the body. They do not kill bacterial infections. They do not kill bacteria. If you've got a bacterial infection, the doctor will prescribe you antibiotics. Antibiotics do not destroy viruses. They do not destroy viruses. If you have a viral infection, you will not be prescribed antibiotics. Antibiotics kill bacteria. And here are two examples of how antibiotics kill bacteria. Firstly, the antibiotic can bind onto the cell wall of a bacteria and kill the bacteria by breaking down the cell wall. By breaking down the cell wall. Antibiotics can also work by entering the bacteria and binding onto the ribosomes of bacteria so they do not produce proteins. This will then kill the bacteria if they cannot produce proteins. Binding onto the ribosomes of bacteria so they do not produce proteins. This will then kill the bacteria. Antibiotics are specific to bacterial organelles. They will only bind the cell wall of a bacteria because humans and other animals do not have cell walls. They will bind specifically to bacterial ribosomes. They will not bind to human ribosomes and therefore kill bacteria only, not killing human cells. It's question time. Attempt these questions to check your understanding. Press pause to practice using those key words. The answers will follow. Press pause to go through your answers and make any corrections to your mistakes. Press pause to answer the questions. The answers will follow. And if you're stuck, just rewatch the video. Press pause to go through your answers and make any corrections to your mistakes. Visit kscience.com. For more free videos, worksheets and quizzes at kscience.com and don't forget to like and subscribe.